That's much better. Alone in the dark. Alone in the dark. Alright. So, begin a new game. Ecstatica is alone in the dark with bows. Oh, that's... So we have to play it then. <laughs> right, so we get two possible characters, right? What should we go for? Um, in the dark, in the dark. You're not helping, game. Okay, let's go with this. The attorney's letter came as a deep shock to me. My uncle Jeremy had died by his own hand. Is this loud the enough, coroner's guys? report was unequivocal. He hanged himself in the loft. Okay, we don't. I don't need to read. Apparently, initial surprise and distress passed. I considered the news. It seemed clear that Dorsetto had exercised a thoroughly morbid influence on my uncle's mind. Dorsetto, it is then. My uncle's mind. That creaking old mansion with its unusual tales, its secret library door, the ancient upstairs clock, all those occult books that my uncle could not resist reading in spite of his fragile nerves. Fate had pointed its finger. Dosetto had trapped its prey. Mr. McCarthy, the family lawyer, suggested selling the old house. I immediately opposed the idea. Calculus, hey. My duty is clear. I must go to DeSetto. I tremble at the thought of those dark corridors, those brooding portraits. Yet I am convinced Sounds that Uncle right. Jeremy left a note. A letter of some kind explaining his fateful decision. I remember his voice saying, Look at the piano, Emily. Look harder. Maybe the secret drawer will yield up an explanation. I have the feeling things will not be so simple. Life yeah. is a mystery. Containing more mysteries. Jeremy taught me that much. Now is the time to confront the mysteries. Dorsetto is waiting for me. I pray that my fear is nothing more than the fruit of my imagination. Imagination. Nothing will ever persuade me that my uncle was insane. But why did he... According to the police report, block the loft window with the old wardrobe. Okay. So we go straight into the game then. There we go. Let me know if the, guy, if the game is too quiet, guys. Look at those polygons. Ribbon. I love the soundtrack. Okay. I believe this was the first time uh, real-time polygonal characters were used in this sort of game, right? Well, look at it, we have the... Yeah, it is. Um, 
we have the basic layout that would later be used for Resident Evil. Pre-rendered backgrounds and polygonal characters. Hey, is the floor broken in there? Careful, okay. I almost, because I... Yeah, I think I've seen this before, at least the introduction part. I don't think it's running slow, I just think the animations are like that. The game speed seems right. Okay, so we go into the attic. Night Night BG, welcome in. Yeah, look. Look at those turns. So that's not slow at all. Let's see how we control the characters. Right, so the arrow keys control the character moving around. Um, space does something. <laughs> you found an oil lamp. Leave, take. Okay, let's take the oil lamp. I suggest saving immediately. <laughs> uh, okay, I don't think we need to do that. Right, that's just DOSBox's thing. It's a trap. Thank you! Okay, so escape just goes to the menu. Music, sound effects, detail level high. Okay. Right, can we configure anything from here? No, we can't. Yeah, if we don't save after the intro, let's, uh, yeah, I'm assuming that's gonna be annoying if we do that. Okay. So, what else? Ooh. Duh. Hell. Uh. I, I have no idea what to do. Uh-huh. Okay. That's sound. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me figure out <laughs> what the controls are first, okay? Right, so, <laughs> let's not move the horsey, let's not move the horsey yet. Okay, so we have shortcuts for sound on and off. Oh, it's happening, isn't it? Okay. Uh, control, Alt, and Shift do nothing. Oh, okay. No, seriously, what do I do? <laughs> mm -hmm. Should I open the manual again? Let me just open the manual again because this is getting silly. Yeah, that's some interesting sound. like this action fight all oh, right so that's kind of that kind of thing okay oh all right so you select an action and then space does the action so if I select fight see kick it kick it okay Again. Okay. Again. <laughs> Again. Almost. Okay. Can we kill it? Seriously. I think we have to somehow. 
Okay, is it dead? Okay, okay, I like this. Okay, this actually is not that complicated. I remember, uh, I remember running is very double tap. Really? Karen one master zero. <laughs> ah, annoying. Okay, I don't think it's working though. Oh, you're right. She starts running after a while, right? What the hell? Okay, can we kill this one? <laughs> well, as long as we are wearing high heels Let's make good use of them. Okay. Bye, Mr. Zombie. Okay, let me figure out how to run, because I'm gonna have to. Double tap and hold, you say? Really? Doesn't seem to be working. No, there's no specific run action, so that's good at least. We don't have to select it. Alright. Um, can we open this? She's trying. Let's approach it from a different angle. Guys, I've never... I say take it. Okay, how about inventory slots? A rifle. Use reload throw. Okay, so it's this kind of deal. Right, right, right. Okay, okay. Infinite inventory, yes. Good. Oh, there you go. What did I do? How did I start running now? Okay, this is creeping me out. <laughs> There's no stamina bar, which is good. Okay, let's practice running again. Oh, you have to be really quick on the double tap. Okay. Right, I get it. Highway 224, welcome in! Welcome back, how are you doing? So, the only problem I'm... The major problem I'm seeing right now is dealing with inventory. Let's pick fight. Uh, let's explore. Can we... And I imagine the actions are not gonna change automatically so you have to specifically select push if you want to push this right there you go at least it works and it's a bit like Resident Evil in that respect also also she has different attack moves depending on what direction key you use with space right yeah, that actually makes sense. I was just using up and down, which is the kick. So far, I love the music, I have to say. Okay, so let's... Right, oh, okay, we can actually punch as well. I was using up and down for the kick, left and right for the punch. Yeah, that's what it said in the manual. Okay. Uh, this camera angle is not perfect.
same thing as with Resident Evil in terms of moving stuff around. You can clearly see a polygonal object, you can move it. If it's a model, it's movable. And so these barrels, for example, are not going to be movable because they're part of the background. At least there's collision with them. Yeah, so in terms of graphical layout, the first Resident Evil game is essentially this, but more polygons. How You really have to be very quick on the double tap to run. Can you guys hear my key clicks? That's not fast enough, apparently. Oh. There you go, that's fast enough. The intro hint about an uncle uh, blocking the window with the cabinet. Now you know, yes, now we know why he blocked it with the cabinet. Because stuff is coming through the windows, clearly. Okay, so there's nothing behind the cabinet, he just... Alright, can I... Search the cabinet, for example. Let's make sure there's nothing in there. Can you make a running macro? Yeah, I imagine I can just use DOSBox to, to to trigger a double tap and bind it to K or L or whatever. Okay, but that would be against the spirit of the game. <laughs> All right. Um, E, I. So I have to get acquainted with kidding I every now and then. Open search. When you select something, it closes down for you, so it saves you some time. There you go. You find a note. Indian cover? Huh. Okay. Good. There was something else mentioned in the intro. Uh, you mean the character intro? Use the piano, he said. That's what you mean? Hmm. The music suddenly stopped. Can't push the piano. Alright. Uh, using the oil lamp on the piano does nothing. Just wanted to try. I don't want to use the rifle on the piano. There is no room. Okay, I can't just drop it in here. You have to drop them in specific areas. Okay. So, judging by the fact that the music has stopped, I think the game is telling us that we should stop being around here. <laughs> okay, I just want to make sure there's nothing else in here. Nothing important. Look, Resident Evil even took that bit, right? Nothing important. So this this game was a huge inspiration on Resident Evil. Okay. That doesn't sound good. You find a book. So he was Translating those manuscripts, right? That's how you go insane in Lovecraft lore. Fragment of the Myth of the Golden Fleece. Translation, Edouard de Villeban. Hesperides Publications. Interesting. Okay, do I flip the pages? I do. Then... Perseus came across Ichios, who had been turned into stone. He spoke to his companions and said, Beware of the Medusa. He who looks into their eyes is doomed to the same fate as that which befell poor Ichios, and will never more set eyes on Seraphos. Must we go blindfolded? asked Imalopes. 
Take up your bronze shields and polish them until they flash in the sun, answered Perseus. Fill your hearts with courage. May Artemis guide us as though we were an arrow from her quiver. Then, but Emelopes was not satisfied. Mm. Why do that, Perseus? Is three inches of sharpened metal not enough to destroy these accursed creatures? Then Perseus drew his sword, which shone and glittered in the sun, and with it he dazzled Emelopes. Now what can you see? The companions of Zeus' sons laughed. Let us set to work so that our shields may shine like mirrors. Okay. Yeah, this is the original Alone in the Dark. And clearly, if you take a look at the way this is structured, the way this is laid out, um, the original Resident Evil took some inspiration from it. Yeah. Okay, are there any more objects in this room that we should try to figure out? Nothing important. See? Nothing important. <laughs> yeah, moving about really feels... Okay, we triggered the music again. I don't know, so far I'm sensing a really nice sort of spooky atmosphere, even though because of the uh, the age technology used for the graphics, you might be put off by this. I'm not. I'm really enjoying it. I enjoy the way it feels. Okay, so... We can always, I assume, go and read the book again if we want. Um, nope, I don't want to minimize and maximize. Um, open search. Let's use open search and see if this works. Nope, this is not going to do it. I hoped we would be able to open the trap door. Maybe you just need to <laughs> approach it from a specific angle. Right, okay, maybe not. Uh, where else should we go? Yes, please go get coffee. <laughs> okay, some of those camera angles though. Over there, I think that's the way out, right? Okay. Let's save. Okay, game saved. No ink ribbons needed. Can we open the door? The worst about the con uh, part about the controls is having to switch instances constantly between search push. Yep. So you have to select the action, and you have one action key. So it's as simplified as possible. I can, I can see how this might be very easy to play with a controller. You just need a D-pad and two buttons, right? Inventory and action. That's all. Okay. What action am I? Open search, right? Let's try the door again. Can't use the oil lamp here. So how do we get out? Do I move the horsey again? Yeah, we can move the horsey. They made the version for the FM towns, that makes sense. Mm. 
Yeah, th that double tap really needs to be very, very quick. Okay, what else am I missing in here? This is not movable. Nothing important. Can we get out the window, maybe? No? Okay. Let's try the trap door again. No. So game, can you please help me out here? What am I supposed to do? I was hoping I could open that door. Maybe I need to be closer. Nope. Maybe I need a key. Stuck. Jammed. There's no door in the entrance. That's a wall. Really? Yes, I am stuck and I am jammed. All right. I got up here, didn't I? Well, didn't I get up here through that door? I'm missing a screen then, am I? Yeah, you're right. I'm missing a screen. Okay. So I didn't get in from that bit. Yeah, I, I already forgot how I got in. Are those just random spooky noises to... Seriously, can we... <laughs> Why does this remind me of the Money for Nothing video? Thank you. That that worked. Yep, that 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 was effective. Nothing important. It's a rocking horse. What do you mean nothing important? Okay. <laughs> That's okay. That's what it's there for. here nothing important okay did I block no I didn't block this out of the way did I? I can't push it back no seriously that's how I got in I think is it just oh yeah that way okay All right, that's not a cutscene. Cut me again. I. Those are. Look, those are really cheap headphones, but I don't know what it is about that sound. It's so realistic. Thank you, Rob. That really got me again. Okay. I think it's because of the positioning of the wall. It, it literally, literally feels like somebody's banging on the wall next to me. Welcome back, Rob. Oh, there's something to take over here. At least when you touch objects, you immediately get... Okay. Oh, those are actually... Sounds that, yeah, they popped up in the library where the book is, that sound. So they sort of give you an idea that you might have to pick up something, maybe. 
And now the sound doesn't play. Whoa, did, it, did we miss something up there then? That sounds logical, doesn't it? See? Okay, let's search this. Entropy star over, good evening. Did you manage to have a bite? Uh, the lady face needs to be a Discord emote. Really? Okay, we can make that happen. Let me just go upstairs again and check. Can't I go upstairs? Oh, I have to position her. Okay, that's just a wall. You're absolutely right. The linguini was nice. Okay, I'm glad. I think that sound we're hearing is supposed to be indicative of stuff to pick up. Is it gonna play again? No, not here. Maybe just plays once to tell you that there's something to pick up. And that was the book in this case, right? Yeah, it feels like it because I think it's, we heard it when we were next to the bookcase. Okay, I'm satisfied with that conclusion. Oh, I thought, yeah, not that way. Over here. Way. Yeah, it doesn't look like the stairs are... <laughs> I don't think there's enough room for the stairs to start going down at this angle. That's why I'm, I was a bit confused about that. Okay. Okay. Are those all rooms we have? So that's how it's gonna be. Okay. Okay. No. Thank you, Axel. I, I, <laughs> That's already a win for me. Look at that. That's... Who does that? Okay. So, is there... Tragic <laughs> isn't it? Okay. So, we should avoid that then. Can we open this door? Oh, we didn't get the oak and you're right. Fudge. Okay. Uh, use fight. Okay. Kick the zombie. Punch the zombie? No. Kick the zombie. Okay. Uh, stop it. No, 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 no. Okay, once he gets into a... Hmm. How do we... Okay. Did that work? Okay. Or hug the zombie, whatever you like. Yeah, okay, so how do we... Oh, 15! Oh, so we get... Okay, let me load. Let me load because... Uh... So that's actually our... I was wondering what that 20 is. That 20 is our health, it looks like. And he hit us five times and... 
we had five off, so that makes sense, right? Mazepo, welcome in. Polygon Festival, yes. Let's get the oil can before we go and try and kick the zombie better this time. Take. Right. Let's you set fight by default over here. How are you doing, Maz? Now, what I like about this, when you go near the doors, you don't have to select open push. It's only for stuff inside rooms. Right, which one was this one? Right, okay. <laughs> 20 polygons. Okay, uh, did we take the shotgun, by the way? A rifle, right? Not a shotgun, a rifle. That totally looks like a shotgun, though. That's not a rifle. Come on, back me up, chat. Okay. Uh, zombie? Yeah, zombie. Let's not waste any of the ammo. I think we should be quick enough. Okay. Alright. Three. Four. Nope. Five. Six. Come on. Seven. Eight. Okay. I think we lost one, right? Yeah, we lost one. Okay, okay. Yeah, I, the sound effects are incredibly cheesy. That's totally... Yeah, I know. No, I don't know why I haven't played this. I have no idea why I haven't played this myself. Maybe I've tried and haven't managed to when I was younger. Who knows? Okay. <laughs> don't kick. <laughs> Nothing important. Okay. Don't kick the wardrobe. Nothing important. Can we sit on this oh, wonderful thing? Kick the dresser. Kick it. <laughs> Fighting in this game is always bad as killing heads in Prince of Persia 2. Well, at least... Uh, we got the hang of it fairly quickly. We're really lucky that the skirt is made of such a stretchy material. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, it looks like the only use for this room is to come in here and meet the zombie. Should we save? You, oh, you get more slots. Oh, two slots. Hmm. Loan 1A. Okay. No! Not this darkness again. No! Not this creeping skin. It's locked. Locked. Okay. We can move. Ooh, you found the key. Look at those keys, though. Yeah, can you guys see the obvious inspiration for, for Resident Evil? Yeah, that door closing by itself was really <laughs> suspicious. Okay, so let's see how we use stuff on stuff. We select the key, we say use, and you actually have to use it. All right, you find a note cavalry saber. Sure, we have a saber. Why not take the saber? That's gonna be the equivalent of a knife, I imagine. That chair is very easily movable. Can we inspect stuff? Sticky chair. No. Nothing important. 
that's the tune I typically associate with this game. That's the tune I know I've heard. Just making sure there's nothing else in here, that nothing else will happen. Okay. Yeah, I'm really glad I... Okay. Let's see how this works. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, is there durability to the saber? Can we use it constantly? No. Okay, good. So we have a we have an edged weapon. It's a shame that Zombie hasn't seen surviving edged weapons. There's a red metal uh, red letter media reference for you. Is it just not? Showing up if there's durability? Is that what you're hooming about, Texpex? <laughs> you seem suspicious about something. Okay, uh, how else? What else? Where else? Aha! Uh, uh, maybe we can mend it later. Now I know, yes. Okay, would have been nice to see some feedback from the actual weapon. Well, other than ju it just breaking apart like that. But, you know, that's fine, I guess. A bow. Extraction. No nuts. Uh, let's just default to fighting yeah it would have been nice to have a different key welcome back welcome back highway right so if we let's save over here You're just so kind. What do I have to say? I'm so I'm I really am touched. All right. So, uh, what we should figure out is Really? Yeah. Uh, yeah, of course I did. Of course I liked it. This sort of thing is always... I'm, I'm just not used to it. There's awesome people around, what can I say? Brad put a knife. Hydrate, yes, good point. Let's hydrate. I have some tonic water with me over here. Mm. Cheap tonic water, nothing better. Okay. Uh, broken saber, a bow, a rifle, a note, oil lamp. Oh, can we combine items? An oil lamp. An oil, uh, an oil can. Use. Okay, so by using the oil can, we immediately filled the oil lamp. I was wondering if we need needed to see something in the dark and figure out a way forward. Uh, wait, what's this way? 
a wall is this way, okay? Who, rede who redeemed sunglasses? I have? I, uh, thank you. Really? Oh, you have? Yes, I do have. Okay, right. I do have a sunglasses redemption. Yes, I do. Please don't do that. <laughs> I mean, if you want to do it, do it. For a second there, I thought somebody redeemed them, and I didn't see it. Okay, uh... Let's save again over here. Uh, I know I probably saved already. Uh, let's see if I die again right away. Yes, okay. Right. Uh, we can't just carry on. No, not B. C, right, okay. Uh, oh, right. Wait, 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 wait. We can jump, can we? Uh, the manual said in certain sections of the game, but not here. No, come back, come back. The jump command will appear when needed. Okay, so this means that we don't reverse this area by jumping and this is already as weird as I expected I am not disappointed at all hmm let's make sure though let's make sure we go there no a bit further forward no okay it should have appeared I think all right are we missing something then Nothing important. Do we get out of the window or something? No, that's not it. Okay. Um. Oh, wait. Oh, you know what? Hey, sticky chair. Uh, let's get the chair out and let's see if the floor falls down Breaks down and then we can jump when we see the, the crevice when we see the, the hole, right? I never realized the right wall of the corridor doesn't have a lamp Really? Oh, chair, dude, cooperate, please Okay Okay, okay, okay is, is that going to work? Nope. Huh. Wait, what? Uh-huh. Uh, well, that didn't work. Okay, it was a good theory, I had to try. The chair didn't fall through the floor, unfortunately. Ugh. Thank you for that, Rob. It's sticky and floaty. I guess there's no chair falling animation in the game, right? Okay, but it does look like we have to use the chair for something, doesn't it? Oh, wait, what's in here? Oh, here we go. Open search. It's locked. Locked. Stuck. Jammed. What else? You have found a vase. Sure, let's take it. Oh. Come on. 
Oh, he's got a in a corner. <laughs> okay. Hit it! Hit it into submission! Come on! Okay, okay! Okay, <laughs> I think we did it. Well, mm. hey, a copy, welcome in. <laughs> Thank you so much for being around. I hope you're doing well. Okay, is this gonna. Yeah. Okay, right. It did drain a lot of our health. It cornered us in there for a bit. I'm, I'm not sure what and if any health recovery items will be available at some point. What's this? Nothing important. Okay. Nothing important apparently. Just pieces of broken mirror, I guess. Let's switch to fight. And that's gonna be the same hallway, right? Yeah, but we're on this side at this point. Oh, nice, a bathroom. This is the first one, yeah. So far it's just as weird as I expected it to be. I'm just getting acquainted with the basic... Oh! Okay, uh, first aid case. That's an interesting way of referring to it. Okay. So it's essentially a Healy. First aid case. Open search. You find a flask. Take. Oh, a flask. Eat, drink. Let's see what it does. Oh, 22. So 20 is not the maximum. Interesting. Okay, okay, right. Uh, an empty first aid case. Uh, that's the vase we picked up. Right, anything else in here? Nothing important. Okay, definitely the nothing important bit in Resident Evil comes from here, clearly. Can we get into the tub? No water. Oh, interesting. I think that's it. In this, can we push this? Push. No, we cannot push. Let's switch to fight. Let's go this way. No reflecting. Two, two. Yeah, it's too early for that. Mm -hmm. Jesus. Oh, isn't that alive? It looks alive. Is it stuck? Oh, no, it's not stuck. <laughs> How dare you, sir! Hit me with your tail like this. Oh, I think we slapped it. And it slapped us as well. Oh, that's not good. No, no, no. Maybe you should use the, the rifle on it. Because it seems to be... Yeah, it's really kicking our... But kick it, slap it. That's the native resolution, uh, Maz. Uh, the game natively runs at uh, 320 by 200, like a lot of DOS games, instead of 320 by 240. Yeah. So the how do you kill this guy or girl, whatever? 
The letterboxing you're seeing is native to the game. I'm not doing it. That's how it, that's how it runs in DustBox. But why would you stretch it? It would be stretched if you stretch it. The proportions would be off. Okay, you feel weak. When do we see you feel weak? At 3, you feel weak. Can't stretch images, that, that would be illegal. Oh. I definitely prefer the... Oh. And we died like this, oh. okay. Oh, let's allow that term. I s sorry, I, s I saw that one in... Ooh, that's interesting. I saw that one in the feed and that's why it didn't get me. So <laughs> Sorry, Jirai. There's nothing to stretch though. If you want to stretch the image, you have to stretch it beyond those black bars. That's just what the game is supposed to look like. Okay. Yes, I cheated. Did not intentionally. I just took a look at the feed and I I saw it there. Uh, no. Uh, D, right? Okay. So, let me... Look, these guys put a lot of effort into making these models seem really nice with the limited amount of, of polygon and scale they could use. Stretching the scale would really... Okay, we have four shells. Or bullets, if that really is a rifle, though it looks like a shotgun to me, but okay. Uh, how do I use it? Use key? Okay, that's all the bullets we have. Yeah, I think the game looks great. Um, given when it was made and how it was made. Okay. Uh, so I guess we fight at this point. Seriously though. For, I think we landed all the hits. Are we just not supposed to be able to kill him? Or her? We got some red pixels coming out of it, just like the ones we get here. I assume we hit it. But why would they stop before hitting it? Seriously. Maybe you're not supposed to kill him, her, them, whatever. But the game conditions you that you meet baddies and you kill them. And this one is really difficult. Is is still going on about stretching? No, we're not going to be stretching a 16 by 10 to 4 by 3. Nope. A lot of those games had this sort of native resolution. Yes, me as well. And as a nerd, you should know that if you stretch them, they will look wrong. So let's not stretch them. Come on. Okay, that's not definitely not going to work like this. Yeah, the native for this is 320 by 200.
That's an interesting animation, really is. The end, okay. We're being dragged. Okay, let's slow this again and maybe go the other way. Let's see if that works. Oh, okay, no. Let me try this shotgun rifle thing again. Yeah, I definitely think we're hitting it. No, we didn't hit it that time. Okay, let me load again. Uh, at least we can do a lot of easy trial and error. I like the animation. Yeah, me too. Let's try and stay in this screen. Maybe we need to do something else. This will not tell you when... Yes. Okay. That makes sense. Well, you know, sort of. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Again, let me put in some more hearts in there. You don't need to. Thank you. You're far too kind. Thank you. Man, we should really get a high P mode at some point. Yeah. In fact, do you guys think we can maybe re replace the rage emote with the high P mode? Would you guys like that? That would be better, wouldn't it? Okay. Keep firing, assholes! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, <Rob. laughs> That one always gets me. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Okay. Look, th there's blood coming out, right? Ooh. Okay. The rifle is empty. Hmm. Let's try and fight it again. Okay, that's not gonna work. This one is quick. Whoa. These ones are quick. Can we get the raging practice? No? No? Okay, that, that stinger is not... Oh! Oh! Maybe this is not about fighting them at all! Huh! Wait, 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 there's something odd about the whole thing. Yeah, I don't think we're... Hmm. It doesn't feel like fighting them makes sense. Because we don't seem to be able to fight them off. What do you guys think? Uh, this is rhetorical, of course. If you know, don't just tell me. <laughs> okay, maybe we should try and looking up to... Oh, that's a glitch. Look at it. That's a glitch. I don't think we're supposed to manifest behind part of the, the wall. Just a slight visual glitch. Yeah, but I'm, now I'm thinking what it would look like on a CRT because some of the really rough edges you can see over here on a nice highly detailed HD screen, a lot of the roughness would just 
go away on a nice CRT or a nice Trinitron, for example. That moonwalking, though. It's locked. Can we use the key again? Uh, where was the key? There it is. Chef's key. No. Okay. Okay, so we can just use... That's not a, a skeleton key or anything. Nothing important. Okay, nothing important over there. Hmm. anything uh... no not every game Rob yeah look at what Yaga is saying hmm. okay so we have to go down these stairs at some point I've played but seen there's a difference, yes. Okay, do we have arrows for this? No, we don't have arrows for this, right? Yeah, we don't. We need arrows before we can fire. Hmm. Maybe we need to be closer. I'm going to try it again. I'm I'm not sure what I have to do with these guys. Maybe we have to stun them and move past them. Because it looks like that one that the other one stopped moving. Wait, can we just run past it? That's not the way to go. Seriously. <laughs> really, Og? Really? Okay, can we... Wait a minute. Can we just, I don't know, jump over this? No? Okay. can't push this uh, let's not fall into the dangerous pit of danger over there can't ex inspect anything else in here nothing important okay so I don't know it looks like we're supposed to <sighs> thank you expects <laughs> I should go through the clips and make sure all of them are appropriate. <laughs> uh, okay, what should we do with these guys? Seriously, let's throw a vase at them. That did absolutely nothing. And now I get to take the pieces. Oh! Well, how was I supposed to figure that out? Come on, game. That's not fair. Okay. All right. Now we have a key. What sort of key do we have? Just a key. All right. Uh, where? This one was locked, right? It's locked. Let's use this key. 
you find a small mirror. Let's take the small mirror. Okay. Okay, why does it not say nothing important? I'm getting paranoid about something still being in there. Oh, two small mirrors. Yes, okay. Am I gonna use the mirrors to fight these guys somehow? I do have the walkthrough on standby just in case, but I'm gonna try and figure some of this out myself. <laughs> Okay, let's, uh, I don't know, let's... Oh, we get three slots, okay. Alone, one, A, B, C, D, E. Or wait, do we actually get more slots as much as we, when we save? The Roku is back sitting. No, we're not, we're not reading the walkthrough yet, it's okay, math. Yes, the classic clone in the dark experience can be, apparently, uh, can be summed up by the phrase, how was I supposed to figure that out? Yeah. In fact, I'm pretty sure I've heard Lilia say it when she was playing Alone 3. <laughs> All right. Small mirror, small mirror. Mm. 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 Drop, put. To be honest, this puzzle isn't fair. You mean the the puzzle I'm trying to figure out right now, or the puzzle with the key? Okay, so there's two of these guys, and there's actually there's two of these statues as well. <gasps> Wait, it has something to do with the statues, right? What if I kill the statues instead of these guys? If I, if you know what I mean. Uh, let's use the rifle. Wait, let's see if we can just break them like this. Oh. Nope. <gasps> no. Okay. Um, before I do anything else, let me just go through Fragment of the myth of the go- Then, Perseus came across Ichios, who had been turned into stone. He spoke to his companions and said, Beware of the Medusa. He who looks into their eyes is doomed to the same fate as that which befell poor Ichios, and will never more set eyes on Seraphos. Must we go blindfolded? asked Imalopes. Take up your bronze shields and polish them until they flash in the sun, answered Perseus. Fill your hearts with courage. May Artemis guide us as though we were... But Imalopes was not satisfied. Why do that? Do we have to, so we either use the mirrors. That it's that is that why we have two mirrors to essentially go past these guys. We don't have to polish our shields. We don't have shields, but we do have mirrors now. How do we use them though? Yeah, look, two small mirrors.
so yeah okay good i did figure it out the book was a clue we use yeah what's the backstory so our uncle who lived in this house committed suicide and we've come to see why uh, we've come to see we're not satisfied with the with the cursory police report that he just committed suicide so we, we're coming to investigate uh, the other hint is even more sneaky. One of the rooms has a picture. Yes, I saw the. I remember. I saw that. Yeah. Okay. Let me save over here. That's actually not too bad of a puzzle, I think. There are hints to this, and clearly. Right. So we get more. Yeah, we keep getting slots when we save. I shouldn't have overridden the earliest save, but that's okay. That's okay. Alone one A B C D E F. Should I keep on with the letters? Maybe not. Let's see. Okay. That's the, the kind of hint we're dealing with. Yes. Let's go downstairs and see what's up. Well, haha. <laughs> see what I did there? Whoa. Uh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Who is that? What is even going on? <laughs> this is so weird. Okay. Sure, of course it comes alive. Why not? <laughs> Let me load. <laughs> Wait, I can't load. Oh, yeah, there we go. Is that Judas? So have I been misremembering the name wrong all along? Anyway, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Let's try to use the rifle. I, st I still say it looks like a shotgun. Nope. Maybe we should quote unquote activate it first. Yeah. Okay. Hey. Stop that. Stop poking me. It's the Certo. Yeah, it's the Certo in the long four. Yeah. So, minor inconsistency. Minus three. <laughs> Okay. <sighs> All right. Okay. Let's try and avoid the suit of armor coming alive. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> No, uh, actually, yeah, why not? Let's, let's go and, no, uh, well, maybe not. Let, before we go there, what's in here? Yeah, the fact that you can just save all the time really makes you feel uh, a bit better about the whole ordeal. You can explore fl freely. You don't feel like you're gonna lose a lot of progress like in Resident Evil. Okay, so there's a lot of doors in here. And I assume, un unless we find some sort of map, there's gonna be no map as such. And these doors are different, so that's gonna... That's the door to the outside, I think, right? Are there gonna be doggos? So don't go outside. Got it. Oh uh, yeah, that's even worse than zombie doggos. I think we got sucked into the nether realm. That was like a living wormhole kind of thing, right? That's what it looked like. Okay, we can't... It's locked, okay. 
Mm. Decades later, I still don't know what that green thing is. Let's ask Sandy Peterson, he probably knows. We just accidentally... What is that? Is it host... Yes, it's very hostile. Okay. Okay, okay. Um... Should I, should I, should I, I don't know what I should do, <laughs> this is so... No. 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 Okay, though, if we don't actually come in here... Let's see if we can actually kill it. Ooh, that's a nice bitch slap. Sorry. I don't usually use that kind of language. Is it gonna die? Any point. Yeah, having a saber would be useful right now. You guys see what we're doing? Oh, there we go. Thank you, Tech Specs. We're literally trying to punch out Cthulhu. No, that's no joke. Okay, uh, no, that's not gonna be... Uh, okay, um, let's, uh, I'm, I'm loading because I wasted the bullets, I think. That doesn't look like it's gonna be dying anytime soon. <laughs> that sound, uh, that sounds strange if you don't see the game. Plan 41. <laughs> see what you did there? Okay, um... Yeah, once you touch a door, you're sort of committed to it. You have to open it. Okay. That looks like an item. A notebook. Is it gonna... S oh, come on. Oh, fudge. Oh, come on. Look at this! The timing... Yeah, it interrupts you, you can't... Okay... I should probably do that again, right? Yeah, let's do that again. I don't know how we're gonna be doing with health and everything, so until I get into the groove of being able to kill these guys easily, I'm gonna reload a lot, guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, either, yeah, exactly, that's what it feels like, Yog. Music is really nice though, isn't it? Okay. Let's try it. Ah, fudge. Ah. Come on. Ah. That's really annoying. Okay, let's see how... Can it die... Like this? Nope. Because I don't get to... Yeah. 
that's really annoying. Okay, nope, not that one. That one. Yeah, that's Rory, she wants to come in, but she knows she can't. She knows she can't because she's gonna be all playful and we can't play right now. Oh, come on! Damn it! Let me do it again. The annoying thing is, it's triggered by me taking the... I can't position myself better, because... Okay. Fudge. Oh god, that's so bad. Come on. Nope. Nope. Okay. Okay. No. 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 Come on! Oh. Fudge. That's so bad, look at this, 15. <laughs> the sound effects are really something, aren't they? Okay. Um. Nothing important. Diary of Jeremy Hartwood. September 27th, 1924. I have decided to keep this diary. Too many inexplicable events have taken place recently. Never have dreams so haunted my every waking moment. Perhaps my romantic mind was too dull and has only now woken up to these new paths and visions. Diary of Jeremy. Sorry. Some, seeing my recent paintings, may question my sanity. Mm -hmm. I can only ask them what is sanity? Where does madness begin? September 28th, 1924. The night is pitch black. I am again drenched in sweat. I was wandering in the dunes, among giant standing stones. They were arranged in a circle and the wind whistled about them. I plunged my hand into the soil and felt that repulsive thing which was trying to catch me. It seized me. I struggled to break free of its loathsome embrace and managed to tear my hand away. It was covered in sticky substance. Mm -hmm. I was gripping a knife. October 5th, 1924. The stone circle is a pentacle. Der Seto's library is filled with books on the occult. I will study those books until I find some explanation for the dreams. The visions that haunt me must be connected to my discoveries. I shall have to undertake a profound exploration of my dreams. Mm -hmm. December 16th. Dear God, I have found the knife. It was hidden here, and what I have learned fills me with apprehension. It is a sacrificial dagger belonging to some unholy cult. Of course. The thought of that blade tearing through human flesh horrifies me. Yet I must continue my research. Their seto is a storehouse of treasures. Was my father right after all? January 23rd. I spend all my days plunged in dusty books. The servants are convinced I am mad. At night, I awaken them with my screams. <laughs> Dreams are draining what sanity I still have. I have tried staying awake, but in vain. My visions have changed. No doubt the influence of my father's research. February 7th, 1925. The Dark Man, uh -huh. that is what I call him, has revealed his true face to me. He appeared, as usual, near the fireplace. But this time... He approached me. His terrible smile will haunt me to my dying day. His breath was ice and his burning eyes froze me. 
I could not move. I know, as surely as I have ever known anything, that the face I saw, the face that has turned my nights into hellish torture, is the mask of death. March 10th. My exhaustion is beyond description. The endless reading burns my eyes. Yeah. It seems that pirates frequented the area. Dr. Herbert insists I keep to my bed. I have moved to another bedroom and sleep much better now. The dark man has not gone, however. I know it. He will wait for as long as he must. I know where this is going. Unless I, Jeremy Hartwood, can find a way to send him back to whatever hell he comes from. March 11th. My poor knowledge of Greek and Latin is a serious handicap to my reading. I have, nevertheless, made a great step forward. I drew the symbol on the floor. He can no longer go there. I want him to understand that I can do the same thing in my bedroom. I can imagine his rage and frustration. Only last night he found his way back into my dreams. March 13th. The translation will seriously dent what money I have left. <laughs> I cannot paint. My pictures are clearly the work of a lunatic. The collector Thornhill's embarrassed smile was proof of that. March 29th. He has come back. He found the door to my dreams. I am too weary to attempt any defense. I have no strength left to fight and he knows it. He considers me dead already. Could I possibly? March 30th. How ironic. <laughs> the cave my father sought for so many years is here. Beneath the house. Wait. The butler discovered a crack in the cellar wall. A breeze blows in through it, icy and repugnant. I am filled with horror at the thought of my father dying in this place. I will carry to my grave the vision of his face contorted in the agony of that fatal heart attack. A heart attack, you say? Mm. His body was twisted. He had wept. His fingernails were torn and bloody from scrabbling at the floor. Dr. Gray concluded that death had been due to a heart attack. It was Waits, who some time later was informed that my poor father had in fact bitten off his tongue and choked on his own blood. Okay, that's that's grim. Uh. <laughs> March 31st. I explored the caverns in a dream. The dark man came with me. Strangely... I felt almost well. How can I describe what I saw? No. What words are capable of explaining such evil? I realized that my death was of no interest to him. The dark man wants something else. He seeks a body. Of course he does. His avid servants are now free. I am the cause. <laughs> it is almost funny. <laughs> A curse is on Derseto. From the foundations to the very rooftop, I can no longer struggle, let alone eradicate the evil that grips the house. The end is very near. I can feel it. I have taken the decision to... May he who finds this diary... Yeah, this guy's doing for an, my soul. an awesome job. I couldn't have done better. Okay, okay. I'm hooked, guys. This is... This is clearly like reading a Lovecraft story. That's what it feels like. I mean, that's intentional. That's... That's the setting. Okay. Alright. Let's save the game over here. I'm... Gonna go to numbers from this point on. Alright. Can we find anything else? Fire oh, there's something missing from above the fireplace, yeah? Hmm. 
Okay, I think we're done with this room. Let's tentatively try and get out. And maybe... What was in here? Oh, that. Yeah, okay. Um, why does this seem familiar? Benny! <laughs> Welcome in, how are you doing? No! Not this darkness again! Um, action, open, search. Take. Okay, let's... Ah, oh, fudge it goes! Um, but it can't get us in here, can it? No, no, Yower! Hey, how are you doing, Yower? Okay, what about this, though? Do we just have to be... We found a jug. Okay, uh, let's just quickly get out. Yeah, I think you're not supposed to kill that thing. I think you're just supposed to get the stuff as quickly as possible and move away. Can't... No, I was gonna say maybe we can't open that door, but okay, that looks like an interesting image. No, okay. Oh, look at that Dutch angle! Come on, that's so nicely done. Uh, that's just awesome. That is awesome. I love this. <laughs> yeah, that's the same dragging, dragging sequence we saw. I think, is it? We're gonna end up on that altar again. I think. This one has zero explanations. Well, why not? Okay. Uh, let's load this again. Let's try taking the stuff from here without losing any health. Uh, the first version of the game I played, a beautiful Chopin waltz in the test scene. Really? Maybe they... Why did they switch it up? Damn it. Move away, move away! Okay, it didn't get us. I think it didn't get us. Yeah. I know I don't know why. Maybe they made sure but most most of these performances there are performances of most classical pieces that are in the public domain that could be used. So I'm not sure why it's not in here. Okay, open search. Like this. Take. Step away. Take. Come on! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's just not... Okay, I think. I think we're fine. Right, so let's go out into the hole again. And see if we can maybe dodge that. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute, wait. It took a large chunk out of us. Let's not... If you know what I mean. Because... That thing really... When it bites, it bites. Okay, let's try it again. Open search. Step away. Okay. Yeah, look, when we get close, it seems to be triggered, right? And when we step away, it calms down. Look at the animation inside there. Yeah, it does. Okay. It got a lot of her polygons, and we don't have much to spare, so we can't waste any. Nope. Bumped into the drawers there, whatever that is. 
Step away, step away, step away. Okay, I think we got it. I think we got it. Okay. Okay, so that's all the slots we have. Right. I have to say, so far, I'm really enjoying the clunkiness of this. Uh, so, can we just position ourselves better for the Dutch angle? Oh. No way! Oh. Come! Oh. Day home. Yeah, they've they've replaced Greek <laughs> heat-seeking access. Okay, okay, okay. So maybe we don't go out there just yet. I guess. Guided access. Yeah, homing guided access. Right. Um. Let's try some of these doors. Interesting. Hey, look, Rob, some of your subjects are over here. Nothing important. That was supposed to warn me. Yeah, of course. When you see a picture of a guy with an axe, you know that. A supernatural flying axe is gonna come out of it and get you if you try to dodge it. Ooh, now we have an arrow. Two arrows, three arrows. Yeah, this is very old school inventory. Okay. Oh, fudge. How are you supposed to... You... Okay, I don't think you can take the arrows without dying. Alright, so far... Yeah, it couldn't be more Resident Evil, yeah, absolutely. And, of course, in this case, it's the other way around, but you know what I mean. It d definitely feels Resident evil -y. Spiders of Stunlock, yes. Spiders possess the ability to stunlock the heck out of you. I couldn't move there. Okay, so maybe we don't go in there before we have spider repellent or whatever. This is this this one is open. Let's go in there. This is just the hallway. No. No, thank you. No, thank you. Resident Evil is a basic uh, inspiration for so many games. Yeah, it's it's quite clear that. Resident Evil was definitely inspired quite a bit by this. Man, at this point I can't wait to play Resident Evil 2. We're gonna get to that. Um, by the way, after we wasted two hours beating the tyrant last time, a couple of days ago, maybe, maybe yesterday or the day before, I tried doing the sequence again, and it took me about 10 minutes, but I managed it. You know, I only died a couple of times. So you really get used to it once, you, once you've done it. Okay, let's see what's in here. Yeah, I did, yeah. 
Um, took me a while, but we did get it in the end, yeah. Just about two hours. Well, maybe not two whole hours, but definitely more than an hour. Take the matchbox. Did you get to save? Yes, I did save the game. I did. Um, you essentially get to save the game in the hallway, so you can load the game in the hallway after you've done uh, the game once. And I think you, there should be something in the in the save rooms for you after you've beaten it once, right? I haven't gone to check. Right, anything else in here? I was sleeping when you beat the game? Well... Oh, how many knives did we take? Why do we... Oh, we can throw the knives, okay. They can be projectile weapons as well. Or in the character inventory. I, do, I didn't see, I don't think there was anything in the inventory than the traditional stuff. Okay, what's this? It's a door. What? What game? This is such a cool angle, but... Oh, okay, 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 Adrian. That's such a poor trick to play. Yeah, we're gonna... You can't get out of this. Come on! I'm trying, guys. I'm trying. But nope. Just doesn't... You don't have time to react once it starts. Yeah. Rebecca! In there. This door. Resident Evil Zero. So, if we're gonna play through the classic Resident Evils, uh, should we include Zero as well? Because it's neither here nor there, right? Oh, this is this door. Okay, right. Yeah, I think that's how you spell it, right? Yeah, Zero isn't really... I know it really isn't the classic. It sort of looks like... Yeah, but that chronologically it is. You're absolutely right. But it's not part of the, the classic engine lineup. Because the engine used in 1 and 2 is essentially the same... And then you get a bit of a graphics bump in, in 3, but it still has a lot of the same tech in there. And 4 is really when when you get the first new game. And um, the way that Zero looks is pretty much just the way that the, the GameCube remake of 1 looks. And there's something about them sharing technology in there, I, I believe. Resi Zero is 964, yeah, that makes sense. Dino Crisis, yeah, I guess you're right, Dino Crisis is in there. Okay, uh, can we... Wait, let me think, where were... Knives were over here. And over here. No water. Okay, no water. 
Right, let's try and beat that zomboid. Maybe there's something in that room that we need. If we turn around quickly. Yeah, there's definitely an object in there. No! Fight! Ah, oh, fudge, it got to me. Okay. Come on. Okay. 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 Oh, f why did I have to punch? Okay. Okay, I think we got him. Oh, that's not great, but I think we got him. Right. What's this? An oil can, so we're gonna be using the... The oil lamp quite a bit. Open search. Can you use the action key to select stuff? In the menu? Yeah, I can. Okay, that's good. It's full of water. Can I use the empty... An empty flask? No, not throw! No, no! Okay. Take. Uh, oh, I can't... Yeah. Alright. A physical copy of the first Dino Crisis, you mean? There we go. We can use a pot of soup. Dino Crisis 2, okay. Can we... Are we actually going to take a pot of soup with us? Uh, okay, sure, why not? Let's take the pot of soup with us. We seem to have an infinite inventory. Didn't I pick up matches somewhere around here? We have Gallifrey and pockets apparently. Pantry. Biscuit box. Key. Find a key. Anything else? Nothing important. Okay. Matchbox. We did pick up the matchbox, yes. We also have a jug, right? Let's see if we can fill the jug with water before we leave. No, not here. Yeah, it's bigger on the inside, exactly. Alright. Jug. Let's use the jug. There we go. Now, it's a jug. A water jug. Well, I would call it a jug of water, because a water jug means a container that's traditionally used to hold some sort of liquid that may be empty. But a jug of water would be water in a jug. So phrasing is important. No water. Mm, almost sounds like we should put water in there. A water jug of water, okay. What happened? Nothing. All right, uh, moving right along. 
So, how do we deal with all of these guys? Because look at that. Are they, are they all gonna come alive? Seriously? Okay. Of course. It's locked? Of course it's locked, okay. I think... No, 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 no. You can't... No, 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 I'm dead. This one is locked as well, okay. Nope, they killed me. And the other one is waking up as well. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, I think I get the picture. Let's not go in there just yet, huh? It doesn't look like... Don't want to beat that person, but the zombies are just... Yes, they are. I, I, I'm th thoroughly enjoying the way they're modeled, the way they sound. All of this is just awesome. I, I'm loving this. If you hear me complaining, don't get the wrong idea. Uh, the game is awesome. I'm complaining about me not being able to play it. <laughs> it's locked. Okay, let's use that key. Nope. Let's use another key. Okay. Oh, that's annoying. Look at this. You have to go down the inventory. You can't scroll back up. But the new items seem to be stacking on top. Dresser key. Okay. Uh, no, I don't want to... Wait, actually, if we don't pick up the arrows... Emily, yes. She is Emily. Uh, you get a choice at the beginning. Edward or Emily, right? Okay, guys, I'm gonna take a very short bathroom break, which I've been putting off for 20 minutes now. <laughs> and I'm gonna be right back. How's it going, Raven? Ads? Really? Just as you came in? I'm sorry, Raven. I'm not playing any ads for you. They're just playing automatically. Okay, this is a very creepy room. <laughs> uh, I, I have this innate fear of mannequin. I thought the games only got weird after after the second one. <laughs> but I see the weirdness has started right from the very beginning of the series. It was saying, yeah, I don't know what it was. That was just supposed to be a droning sound, I guess. I, I don't think it was supposed to be saying anything. You remember this game? Good. I've never played this myself. Okay, let's see if we can actually... Over here was that spider room, right? Coton, welcome in! How are you doing? Happy Halloween, indeed! Let's get a shout out for Coton. I hope you're doing well. 
you guys, if you like Tomb Raider, do yourselves a favor, go and check out closing stream. Okay, um, that was the room with the things, right? Yeah, okay. Can we not trigger them, please? If we don't move closer to them... Yep. You found the record. Let's take the record with us. Okay, it looks like there's an item that we need to pick up beyond those, but let's not trigger them because we know what's gonna happen. I think I touched them and that color out of space coming came in here and killed me. Okay, let's use that key maybe. No. Yeah, if you use the key, it should be able to unlock the door if it's meant for that door. Uh, let's switch back to fighting stance. Okay, let's not take the arrows. Though it feels like we should be able to take them without dying, but who knows. That key's gotta be for... Oh, you know what? I bet it's for that room with the zombies, huh? Okay. Let's go and try that room then. Okay, let's save over this one. So, if you're quick enough, let's see if I... Uh, a key, use. Nope, not for that door. Okay, let's fight off this zombie first, if we're quick enough. Nope. No, the second one gets up right away. I don't think I can fight... No, I can't fight two of them at the same time. Okay, zombies, chill. Uh, there was another door, right? In there. Let's try that one. The one to the side. Um, but there's a zombie in front of it. Hmm... Ooh. Why is this one so much quicker? Let's get out of there. No, 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 no. Okay, that's not it. Uh, what else, what else? Let's try shooting them, I guess. Where's the damn rifle? Oh, there it is. Okay. That's quite sound every time I sit down. <laughs> okay, let's see. Okay. Not for that door as well. Okay, can we get out of here? Oh, now it's locked? Really? Okay. Don't stick to me, chair. Oh, we, how did I miss? No, no, no. Once he stun locks you, yeah. Okay, well, I. 
Right, not that room then. At least not for now. What was in here? Okay, let's see. This one is locked. Nope. Thank you, game. One more. One more. Okay, right. No. Okay, that one's waking up. No, and not for that door as well. Well, that's okay, then we can load. If you know what I mean. <laughs> I, I am getting a slight headache, I have to con <laughs> confess. It's right. a trap. Sheesh, thank, thank you. Rob, was that you? <laughs> thank you. <laughs> okay. Um, no, 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 let's not get in there. Uh, let's, no, 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 no. Uh, let's go out. Uh, okay, at least you can go out. <laughs> Turn around and move that way. Okay, I don't think we want to try the one out there. I played this one PS1. Really? Oh, you played the one. Sorry, I'm not following chat. Sorry, guys. This is just... That's dark. Who? The fudge? <sighs> Great. Nice time to switch screens game. Nice backflip, my dude. Nope. Missed. Okay. Load it is. New Nightmare on PS1. Alone 4 on PS1. Yeah, okay. Yeah. When Ilya played Alone 4, this was such a fun time. And we still don't know what's in that chest, do we? From a long four. <laughs> Judas the Serto. Uh... He's not dead. Is he gonna kill us if we get close? Yeah, okay, okay. No, not that one. <laughs> okay, um, new plan. Let's not go there. I, uh, Dreamcast as well. Yeah, same gen. Alright, so that's that room. What about this one? It's locked. Of course it's locked. No. Right, can we go in there without... 
Maybe we should get whatever. Could, could we maybe just take the book? Nope. Maybe if we run. The fact that you. The double tap for the run is really, really sensitive if you're not really, really quick on it. No, there's nothing else in there. And he really does get us quite quickly. I guess we can avoid him. This one is locked, okay. Keep pressing escape instead of I for inventory. Uh, a key, use the key. Nope, not for here as well. So, where the hell should we use it? I'll be going to bed. Okay, I'll go and come and check in on you in a bit. Night, night. Say good night, night, rupee, everyone. So that guy is a ghost, I'm assuming, right? Because when you hit him with a shotgun blast, he just does cartwheels. <laughs> oh, I don't think my neck is supposed to be making that sound. Ah, sorry. Oh, jeez. Hmm, okay, let's explore a bit. We've been going for two and a half hours, seriously? Can we still go upstairs? Okay, let's try going upstairs. Are you implying that, oh, ghost, no. <laughs> that is not what I'm implying, no. Oh, we didn't come in here first time around. There's some more matches, I think. Is that a ghost? That is clearly a ghost. Okay, step away from the Chardonnay. Uh, let's not let this get us. Let's move away. No. Okay, this is... The way that goat stood up. This is really spooky. I know it's... Thank you, game. More of those spheres, yeah, I don't know what, how you're supposed to handle them. I guess you just run away from them. Wololo. Ayo ho ho, wololo. Hey, you want to play Age of Empires 1? Okay, um. Actions, open search. Okay, that ghost is still there though. Oh, box of cartridges. Okay. You know what? Let me save. Oh. Can we take the gramophone without triggering the spheres of doom? Oh, I cannot carry anything else. Huh. Well, that's new. Okay, so we have to solve some part of the stuff before we carry on to this. I hope I haven't softbought myself at this point then. We can drop, right, we can drop stuff, clearly. A broken vase. Why would I need that? Huh. And not all slots are created equal, it appears. Right, do we have, still have the chest key? 
Yeah, it's a very cumbersome system. Okay, so the chest key is something we've used already. I think we can safely drop that, right? Okay, I can't just... What else can I drop? You just leave stuff around here, I guess. I don't want to drop the oil lamp, not yet. I'm gonna, maybe I'm gonna need this. A broken saber, should I keep those? That's really hard to tell at this point. A pot of soup. Are we gonna pour it over someone? I don't know. <laughs> a biscuit box, a key, a record. Oh, oh. Can I just use the... Maybe it will suit the ghost. No, leave the key here. Let's go into the inventory while we're right next to the grand... Why would I want to pick the record player? Uh, pick up the record player anyway. Maybe I should just use... The record. Wait, didn't I pick up the record? Oh, there it is. You have nothing to listen. Really? How close do I have to be? It's right there! Okay, this is gonna bug me. Maybe from this side. have nothing to listen to okay I'm gonna try from the other oh look at that that is really spooky look at this I mean from this side I I disagree that's a record clearly that's a record player and that's a re record right so let's use it did you turn off? No? Oh, didn't sound alert not play? Sorry, Rob. Hmm. It almost looks like I'm trying it. Right? No. Apparently, maybe it's not for, for this area? I don't know. Okay, there's something on the side of the... Yeah, I get it, I get it. There's something on the side of the fireplace over here. Uh, open search. No, nope. really? Guess, I guess not. Hmm. Okay, the ghost definitely gets up at this point. You find a poker. Let's take the poker. Let's take the matchbox. Let's... No! Is the gramophone gonna be my death now? Alright. Can we go up, please? Oh, once we trigger that, it's gonna follow us, right? Can we wait it out? Uh, yeah, I do have cats, yeah. <laughs> I'll go and find a cat for any moment. Let me just figure, figure this out. Oh, oh. Oh, it's still here. It's still here. Oh, no, it's... What? What is even going on? Okay, okay. Oh. On that note, let me go and find a cat. <laughs> and that one comes alive as well. Seriously, this game is just so much. Okay, let me just load this. I'll be right back. 
you guys we've been going for two hours 45 minutes uh, I do need to end the stream in about 15 minutes or so so let's see how much we can figure out um, now you have to get up really really early in the morning he feels better upside down no he's he's lying to the side and that's how he usually sleeps as well yeah it's mostly because of brain trauma in this case um, and they are cats of this type the white and orangey are susceptible to it quite a bit okay so how much how sensitive is that bit welcome to the HEV mark 4 protective system oh Dentity welcome in thank you so much for following Hope you're feeling well tonight. Okay, so what's the deal? And Rory's in the room as well, and she's looking at us a bit suspiciously. So this one is locked. Let me try the key again. It's almost like I'm not. Feels like I'm not using the the keys right. I did use the the chest key the same way though, so that's the way they should be used. Yeah, he calmed down. Because I'm not moving him around at this point and he isn't feeling dizzy. Okay, is he gonna follow us as well out here? Hmm, no. He doesn't follow us to the outside. I really don't know what to do with that guy. It's locked. I'm not sure if we should try to fight him. There's so much going on at this point and our in oh this is this place okay um how many of them in here let's try and kill some of them i guess oh what about knives this is gonna be effective against them okay you can swing really quickly with the knives and they're gonna break as I, I imagine but you know that sort of works would you like a hint about the message you can't carry anything else um, it doesn't feel like sure go ahead text specs I shouldn't have broken the saber, should I? Um, okay. That one is gonna disappear. What's up, D? Okay, that one's coming alive now. That's a chair. I looked away. Come on! Oh, well, I shouldn't have looked away. And now they're gonna kill me. Yeah, that's not good. Okay. Um, there's a weight to object, so to carry. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. That's what I thought. Yeah. I, because I kept throwing away small items and it still said you can't carry anything else. And the thing is, when you look at the objects in the inventory, it doesn't really give you feedback about which one and how much they weigh. Uh, 
let's try this again. You want up, boy? You do? Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's okay. Alright. This one is locked and this one is the room with the... with the guy. Thank you, game. Okay, uh... Knife. Equip one of the knives. Let's not get distracted this time around. He is a mini tiger, yeah. That's why you call him tiger. Alright. Yeah, it's much easier to kill those guys with the knives. How did I not? All right. Okay. This one disappears. Good. Which one is gonna? Okay. Ah, fight. That's such a silly way to... Oh! Nope! 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 Get away! Get away! Oh, come on! That's so silly! <laughs> nope! No, 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 no! Come on! Swing! 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 Damn it! Oh, that's so annoying! Hmm. Yeah, okay... <laughs> I don't know what to do... <laughs> Alright... Um... I'm out of ideas. Should we try that again? Nope! Oh. Oh, Can't afford to lose any of that health. Should I try and fight that guy? No? Yes? Maybe? I don't know. Oh, did I try the key on this door? No, no, okay, it doesn't work on that door either way. What was that other room with the zombies? Let's try to, to deal with that one first, maybe. Yeah, the other one. Over here uh, again, let's try with one of the knives like this. Oh, isn't that wait? That's the same room, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay, yeah, we're just entering it from that other door. Okay, yeah, I was really confused about why would there be two dining rooms with. No! With zombies sitting around. Which one? Now? Yeah, it sounds like they're gurgling more than anything else, but. Oh, such bad timing! They sound like a broken door. <laughs> yeah, they do. <laughs> they must be hungry. That's where they're in the dining room. It was Emily with a knife in the dining room. Okay. Okay. We 
wish we had food for them. Well, whatever they feel like eating, I don't feel like parting with it, if you know what I mean. I think we're gonna need our brains. Oh, fudge. Okay. Um... No! No! Why did I have to do that? When you hit the zombie... Wait a minute, I can't escape now. Of course. Okay, let me try it one last time because this is getting really annoying. Um, let me see if I remember. Uh, nope. Ah. Didn't get me. Oh, he's gonna follow me now, but of course. Okay, let's not go there. Over here, yeah, over here is an easier way to enter the room. Equip the knife. I feel like if I'd managed to save the saber at the beginning, maybe I still could have used it. Oh, come on, I hit the damn... Come on, hit him! What are you doing? I'm, I'm trying, guy. I, I'm really trying. Yeah, he's, he got me. When, when they stun lock, he was just not possible to. Thank you, game. Nope. Yeah, that sound effect is definitely random then. Careful. Wait, why am I so confused about this? Wait, 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 what's going on? Did I lose? Where am I supposed? Over here? What? Yeah, over here. Okay, yeah. It's this way, not that way. Knife? Uh, move away. So, if you don't touch them, they seem to wait. What, what? What is the deal? What is going on? I'm not... Is the game now spazzing out because I can't press space and that's it? Uh, let me try it over here. Okay, so it's working. That's very weird. Over here. It's okay, Tiggy. Yeah. <laughs> Rory's getting closer. I think she wants to make an appearance as well. Okay. Alright. How? How are you doing that, zombie? I don't know. Once it stall locks you, you just can't react anymore. They also sound like someone. <laughs> yeah, they do. Down here. Come on! The damn running thing is starting to annoy me. How you literally have to... Knife. Use. Come over here, zombie. 
Nope. Look at this. Look at this. You can't... And I don't even know if that's what I'm supposed to do, by the way. I'm just going on me being able to sort of do something in there. Come on, run, damn it. Oh, uh, nope. Uh, knife. Use, okay. Let's get in there. Let's not bump into that zombie. Let's not drag the chair with us. What is going on? Is it just my... What am I doing? Okay. 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 Once it gets a bit closer... There we go. This one evaporates. Now that one in the corner, I think, yeah. Bit closer. Oh! Okay. It's very hard to see what I'm doing. Nope. Nope. Got us. Killed us. That I don't know what I'm doing, guys. <laughs> yeah, the fighting system is a bit convoluted, I have to say. Just a tiny bit. I'm gonna try it again because I don't know why. But I'm gonna try again. Over here. Run in with a knife, sure, that's a very good idea. Okay. Wait, before we move on to the next zombie... Nothing important. Well, okay. Should I maybe wait in the open for him like this? Yeah. Could be worse flying heads. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Move, step away a bit. Okay. So they take four hits with the knife? Yes, four hits with the knife. Okay, which one is next? That one. Let's save. Why am I not saving? Um. Wish there were a quicker way to save and load, but you know, that works as well. Okay. Okay. Two, I think. Three, and one more. Four. Okay. Which one is next? That one. Uh, I'm gonna wait over here though. It feels like when you're out in the open, there's. It's a bit easier to see if you're hitting or not, if you know what I mean. Okay. That's one. 
Not close enough. Two. Okay. Just a bit closer. Three. And one more. A tiny bit closer. Four. Okay. And over you in the chair. Shall you join the party? Yes. Okay. All right. Ah, uh, all right. One more. One more. Now. Yay, good. The fundamentals of martial arts spacing is. <laughs> okay. Um, let me save over here. Let's inspect the table. Nothing important. Let's inspect the very nice looking fireplace. Nothing important. Again. Oh, now it opens, yeah. That's that room though, so that's not really that important. Again, let me try and... Okay. Use that key. Mm, no. Uh, now that you've done that I can say... You could have used the pot of soup. Seriously? Oh, they're in the dining room. They're hungry. But they're zombies. What? Aren't they? What? Okay, guys. I'm... I I, I am sorry to say though, I have to end the stream here. <laughs> so, I'm gonna collect some energy, collect some thoughts, and we're gonna carry on with this tomorrow if you feel like it. I would be, it would be awesome if you can join me again.